only going up. They don't need to go up because it's bullshit. Like, every money we make it, but 2K, bro. I know the hell y'all did not just do this, bro. 2K, why is the VC up when I upgrade? This is some bullshit, 2K. Like, I have to spend that much VC just to get a 2K. Like, Come on, bro. You... Like, look how much I got in his cart. And look at the price. Like, it's pissing me off because, like, we have to spend two to three times that now to upgrade. Bruh, if you was on 2K23, you try to upgrade this much stuff at one time, you finna spend like 100 to 200,000 BC. Tell me online. No, you're not lying. Ain't no way y'all that. You, you only need 2,000 BC to get that shit. And let me show you that stuff, bro. And I put that back. That shit, bro. You want to get both of them? How about y'all give us a voice? I think it is a beautiful thing. I wish I would have shot more threes as a player. Maybe I would have got to 15,000 points. But let's focus on this league and the way the guys are playing. Matches ain't been that one. Matches ain't been that one since Shaq and Dwight Howard. going to continue to evolve in deeper threes. Now Golden State's starting five. To be honest, I don't know why two kids like this. Alright, so I'm going to tell you a story so about how I met my girlfriend. It was there, but it's your boy Drew. I bet we're this video today. Hey, man, I said I was going to take a break, but I'm going to tell you a story time how I met my girlfriend. Um, how did I met my girlfriend, Sierra? Um, so I'm gonna tell you the whole story. Uh, it's gonna be a long gameplay. And I know uh, 2K20. Like I played 2K, I was supposed to play AEW, but I'm gonna go to AEW videos to come tomorrow. Here's Book Knight. And it's off from three point range. Golden State's gone two of two from three point range here in the first quarter. Here's Jay. He claims. <laughs> That one off the back iron. It was, and down it falls. Jay's it was yeah, but it's your boy Jamal. Hey, right um, today Jay we're gonna do something different. Today we're gonna do something different here. So for me, I'm gonna tell the story how I met my girlfriend. So we playing some two K on my career, even though two K is boring. Like I play two K, but damn, um, it's not the same no more like it used to be. So I'm gonna tell you a story how I met my girlfriend. Um. Chandler, so her name is Lay. I'm gonna tell you the story. How I first met her. How long we've been dating for a while. Now, and Carroll. what's our plan for the Tries future? The and shit, you know, inside, um, like and I've been, big, so, but I told you I promise you I'll upload Monday. I did upload Monday. But I'm gonna upload say AEW video tomorrow. I'll you see how I feel with the future. I hope we finish the game enough. because I'm tired of playing AEW right now. Good. So we're Keep playing some quick gameplay of my career. I'm gonna tell you the story. How um. I met my girlfriend, so we're going to start with 12th grade year, so that's why I met my girlfriend in 12th grade year. Um, 
I have, like, for me, I have been talking, I had talked to her since 12, all the way to 12th grade. I, she was in, she was, she was new in 6th grade in middle school, because I went to Georgetown Middle School, both, both of us was in the same middle school, but I haven't met her that year because 6th grade, yeah, I was in a relationship with a different female, and plus, I wish I had met my girlfriend in 6th grade, but now I have her now, but, but that's besides the point, but, so then we're going to start with 12th grade year, so we're going to start with my 9th grade year where I first met her, so I met her in 9th grade year, so she was, um, walking, she was walking in the lunch, we had, we had like first semester lunch, so I was the first semester lunch, whatever that shit called, so it was me, I was hanging out with my homeboy Sean, well he's, well Sean, he used to play drums, he used to play instrument and music and shit, and I had him in gym in first half period, it was me and my cousin Karan, and then it was Sean, and then we both had like class together, we had to go outside, and run track, and shit like that, outside, in the high school and shit, so, um, in his own. And so it was a, it was just lunch one time. She came from a nurse. She walked like outside because they had like a you know with the bus ramp that we could walk and then we could get inside of the schoolhouse with the parking with the bus at. That's where we was at. And then we was at lunch. We could go out. We could go outside because this lunch had like it had like fucking benches and shit. And then they had like cameras and shit. And you could see, see the basketball court and the football court. Yeah, even though I missed up that guys, but. But we was at the basketball court, like close to the basketball, close to the gym doors, and and after we met, so she came outside. She, I, I think she went black. She had a black wig on with some red glasses, and I remember Sean said, "Hey, what's up, Sierra?" I'm like. I said, damn. So, like, she was, like, she was a beautiful girl. She was cute and shit. And she was fine. Like, you know how people glow up when you see them in middle school and shit? They, 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 like, people think they ugly and shit, shit like that. I don't, I don't think she was ugly. She was, she was still beautiful because she was beautiful and cute, you know? She had a little bit with her. She was still beautiful and cute. But when she came to high school, she slimmed down. She got fine and shit to high school. I said, I have to get that in my mind. And I said, damn, she's beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Like, that was how I was. I said, damn, she's beautiful, like, I'm gonna have to get her, so, I don't remember, she was talking to Sean, I'm gonna say, yeah, um, cause she had, like, sec sickle cells anemia, whatever, sickle cells, cause I said, oh, you have, like, what the rapper product she had, so, she had cooking class, like, um, she had cooking class, but she had cooking class at that semester of my ninth grade year. So 10th grade, ninth grade, like I haven't seen her since the 12th grade. So um, when I, I started talking to him in the 12th grade, so me and I had the same class. It was Coach K. We had English. So um, after lunch, because I had, I had lunch with her cousin and her her, friend, her close friend, her childhood friend Maya and Deshaun. So um, her friend um, so her friend was in the in the lunch room with us. It was me. Cause we could get outside lunch cause was, this is our senior year cause we could do anything with the fuck we want so this is our senior year so I met my girlfriend and Coach Kikas I remember she was standing right there went in the, like in the hallway waiting for our teacher Coach K cause he was used to be a football coach or so a wrestling coach or so whatever you say he was so um anyway I met her I said she had like this nice ass Dragon Ball Z shirt it was a Goku like it was, it was a Goku picture, and he was super saying, I said, I like that shirt, I said, I want that shirt, so that's how I first started the conversation when I first met her in my 12th grade year, and she just started smiling and laughing, and she, she said, nah, I can't get it, and then we just started talking, and then the next day she had like a Juice World shirt on, and the next day we, we were talking to her, I, mean, I, I got to know her a little bit, I didn't get to know her that yet, so, um, so after we were just talking and shit, I, I didn't know what to say because I was nervous. I was just staring at her in the class. Even though that's some weird shit, I know it was weird. I was just bored. I was a quiet, I'm a quiet person. If y'all know me, I'm really chill, laid back, I'm a quiet person. And I was quiet in that whole class. I was all the way in the back of the room with the AC at, like, with the windows at, but they had a window. They had a window in the front, but I was all the way in the back with her cousin, Damari, and them, and shit. So, then after, after that, I met her, so this next day, so after it was, it was her cousin in the class, two of her cousins and her childhood fr close friend, it was her friend Maya, when they was friends, they was middle, so they hang out together, so anyway, she was in a relationship at the time, I just got out of the relationship, so I was in a relationship at the time too, and I'm gonna tell y'all, like, how we got together and shit, and how, like, how did we first start, like, talking and take everything serious. So, 
So that start on the second day when we first got in the class. She had on this jacket and a juice world shirt. And she had she loved X X discussion. I love X, but like she had this juice world um she had this juice world um fucking um shirt. It was a paint shirt with him and his eye like sticking his tongue out. And I said, Yo, you gotta give me that shirt and shit. So I put a photo up and everything. I was just being friendly, doing what I'm doing, like, you know. So I, I really said I was trying to get her because I don't remember her. I remember seeing her because she had the same glasses. And I, and I like, I don't remember her. And shit. I'm like, I'm going to have to get her. So, you know, and I, then I got her Facebook. And then after that, I got her Snapchat. She texted, she got, I got her Snapchat first. I got her Facebook and then I got her Snapchat. I added her on Facebook and Snapchat. And then next thing you know, we would just start texting on Snapchat. And then all the way to November, we were texting all the way to November to December, all the way to January, all the way to um, fucking graduation. We were about to graduate together. So me and her started texting and shit. And then I was like, I didn't know who I, like, I was in a relationship at the time. I was just getting to know her. I got to know her. And then next thing you know, we were just flirting a little bit. You feel me? Because we was going through some shit in our relationship. She broke up with her nigga because the nigga was texting her. And then, for me, I was going through something with my relationship. I didn't want to be with her. Like, for me, I'm not going to say my ex name because I don't want to say it. So, I was staying with her at the time. And then next thing you know, we break up because we need her bitch with some shit. She was, she was on that bullshit talking about some, oh, why I never call her and shit. Why I never check up on her. But I actually did call her. She never, like, called me and shit. Because she was playing on my talk. She was playing on my feelings and shit. Not playing, not playing on my feelings, but playing on my talk. Like, keep on fucking with me. Like, fucking with the wall. Like, keep on playing with me and some shit like that. You know what I mean? Keep on playing with the nigga talk. So, in December 1st, me and her have broke up. And I was cool about it. So me and Sierra, I remember that me and Sierra were just talking. She was checking on me. I told her I was not gonna be at school because she said because she was just texting me and smiling. So I told Sierra I like I was not gonna be in school on Christmas break because we had Christmas break. I remember that we started dating and shit. So this is how we started dating, y'all. So this is the this is December. This is like a Christmas day, a 2021. So we got together on December 2021. We was talking in November, then we got together on December on Christmas break. So I don't remember she texted me. She called me, babe. I think she was drunk. I go lie, she was drunk when she had coffee, babe. And then next thing you know, all I remember is we were just playing, calling each other, babe. And then next thing you know, she said. Like, I would make a part two, and I'm putting her in the video, and I'm going to try to ask her to put her in the video and shit, so I'm going to ask her if we do a part two, and then she was explaining this, like, it because she was explaining it, but I'm going to say it like this, she texted me bae, and then we were just, and then my mind, and I said, oh, I'm her bae now, I said, okay, bae, and then we were just calling each other bae, the next thing you know, she woke up this morning, the next day, because I was going to school that time, I was good and shit. And I wasn't, I wasn't, I had my surgery, was healing and shit, this morning because I had to take my uh, wisdom to out. And then we would call each other Bae, the next thing you know, we were just talking to each other, we called each other Bae, she called me Bae when she was sober and shit, and then we would just, and that's how we start kicking off and shit. And then, after that, we started hanging out at the library, like, because we, we had the same class, and then we were just talking to each other and shit. Then we was hanging out at the library. We were just hanging out at the library. We were just cuddling and hugging each other and shit. You feel me? And then, and then we were taking pictures and videos together. And then, and that people, and you know what's so funny, but people didn't know yet. We were trying to keep that shit to a secret because we didn't want no. I didn't want nobody to know I was seeing this girl because people like you know how people is when you're in school and then you know people that fuck with you and you know and then they going to find out anyway. That's that's how that shit happened. So we went for a second semester. After second semester, we had the same class. We had like um science or social studies and some shit like that. And then I remember that we had the same class. We had the same lunch at the library. And then we used to see each other because I had this other class when Shaquille and them and them and then Christopher, one of her friends. And then next thing you know, everybody started, find, everybody started coming up to me and talking about some, oh, like, 
Oh, I heard you dating this this girl, this Sierra, bro. I'm like, what's up, my friend? I'm like, the fuck, like, nigga, how these niggas know I'm dating this girl already, bro? I would reach out our best to keep that shit to a secret for a while, and then this girl, and then this nigga, well, her ex boyfriend, confronting her about this shit, talking about some, oh, who you dating? Who you dating? Who you dating? And the nigga find out. And then the light skin nigga, I think, well, the nigga is light skin. Let's say the light skin nigga had a problem with it, with the thing. And then my, then some girl had a problem with it. I'm not gonna get to it. I make, I make a part two about that. So if like I'm gonna make a part two about that, to, like later on today, later on tonight or tomorrow. But that's we're gonna just start. We're just gonna get stop right there for the day. And I'm just letting you know. But that's part of it. Part two is coming tomorrow or some shit like that. Why? Why upload AEW gameplay? I'm not gonna play online on AEW. But that was part of it. So we're just gonna stop right there. Just know that second semester people. Like find out, and then the second class. That's when people start to find out. That's when her friends start hating me and liking me. Well, her ex, I had a problem with her, with her ex and shit. And then this other girl, I let y'all know about that part too. But thank hey, bro. I hope y'all like this video. And this, I'm gonna make part two tomorrow. And I love y'all, bro. Peace out. I'm sorry.